Why don't you ask for equal rights for all inhabitants of Israel and Palestine, one state for all people, equal rights for Palestinian, uh, Palestinians and Israelis? Uh, this, is, this is one, uh, I mean, one of the uh, alternatives that I talked about earlier when I said uh, the status quo is, un uh, if, if the two-state solution is not realized, uh, then the status quo is not sustainable, and the only alternative we may end up having is a binational uh, one state, uh, where, uh, where, where Muslims, Jews, and Israelis can all live uh, in, 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 in one country. Uh, I think uh, if we do not realize the two-state solution, uh, we are already seeing uh, growing support for uh, the notion uh, you know, of, of having one binational state among the Palestinians and among even some Israelis as well. But uh, I personally don't know if that would be the solution. Uh, I, I don't think that it will uh, provide an immediate solution to the problems because today you have 1.2 million Palestinians who are living as Israeli citizens. The only equal right they have to their uh, Jewish counterparts is the voting right. Other than that, they don't have any rights uh, within the Israeli, uh, in the Israeli society. So uh, the binational state, yes, if we can guarantee that it will be equal and everybody will be equal, then it will be maybe, uh, uh, and this is not my official position, okay? It will be uh, maybe an option if the two-state solution is not realized. But if we cannot guarantee equality, then we will create a situation that will be difficult to sustain. And I don't think that this would be wise. Yeah.